All right, hi everybody, Sucrose here. Um, it is late, I cannot sleep, and it is about a thousand degrees in my apartment. So I'm back to play some Cuphead, and hopefully uh, exhaust myself to the point where I can sleep. Um, we were working on these DLC bosses, trying to beat them um, in S mode. So I'm, I played around with the volume settings because that record scratch doesn't seem to be as affected by in-game volume, so I'm gonna have, the title screen's too loud and the in-game music is a little too quiet, I think. I'm not sure how that's gonna be, but we'll see. So we, we finished the ice boss, we did the giant boss, we did whatever this was. It seemed to unlock the um, the relic. I don't really understand what we did. <laughs> but um, uh, let's let's try the plane. So expert and. So the question is, what what loadout do we want? But I guess we'll give it a shot and see what makes sense. Hmm. So I, I uh, you know, we played this one before, right? Okay. So there's a dog come in with the soccer balls. It it wasn't too tough before, but that was um, that was on standard mode. There's obviously a lot more tennis balls on the screen, and maybe that's it. It's the tennis balls. Oh, I don't remember the fire. Five points. All right. I think uh, I think I recall the first phase. This um, the chaser really isn't doing a whole lot of damage. Maybe we'll switch back to the new weapon that's chaser plus, and see if that's any better. Um, I mean, might just be able to do. Roundabout, and then we use this if we need um, to not focus on where we're shooting. <clears throat> so, like, as long as I look away, definitely want to stand in the middle of shoot. Ah, oh, but then he's at the top of the screen, so then then I have to. Um, okay, so that's it's not bad really. I think I can do that. All right, and this is significantly more damage, so this is probably the way to go. Um, but even even with the chaser, this is a lot. This is a long round. All right, so this one, this one was quite easy, if I remember correctly. I mean, it's gonna be it's gonna be tougher without. Um, I mean, on expert, I assume they take more damage at the very least. And then this 
This is mostly about dodging these lasers, right? And red goes down? I I don't know how to do this. I can't I can't think in, in two dimensions. <laughs> I'm strictly a one dimensional thinker. I can't even see that. Like, is it cheating to turn my head? I feel like it's cheating. <laughs> but it works. You know? Um, this works ish. Wow, we were about to get hit. Um, well, there's our first expert win for this boss. Too slow. Too slow, and we got hit, but that's... everything else is... is right there. Um... Let's switch Chaser to this. I wonder if we can... we can do Twist Up, because... Twist Up... might work for the second phase. The third phase, I mean. Let's try this again. Let's even we can even try twist up for the first phase. Uh no, because then we have to switch when he switches. It, it's funny, right? Because um <laughs> I should be comfortable switching weapons. Uh but but I'm really not. Um Alright. I'm definitely my reaction time is definitely slowed by, by how late and tired I am. Um, clearly not tired enough to go to sleep, but It took damage. Oh, it did. Gosh darn it. I'm not sure this is, uh, this is actually hitting. Oh yeah, that's that's not gonna work. Um, oops. Wait, what? Where's the hitbox? What's taking damage? I don't see what's taking damage. Is it the lasers? So when the female dog is in the tongue, she's definitely taking damage. But when the lasers are out, I'm not sure what's taking damage. Something is sometimes taking damage, but like... Not always. 
that's really unclear to me. So if we switch back to this, um, maybe I'll switch to that when we get to that phase just to see what's taking damage, you know, where they go. Although Chaser isn't always super accurate. Like sometimes it goes to things that explicitly don't have uh, hitboxes. Rather not take that uh, take that hit in the first phase because I feel like the first phase should be the easy one. Um, compared to this this uh, this afternoon. I'm definitely feeling the the effects of um, not being sharp. Well, that's a shame. But now we know that they have hitboxes. Still at 3 HP. Okay, so here's here's the challenge, obviously. So, yeah, it's the lasers. Well, we should get practice on this, but... Honestly, I I want to flip the monitor, right? Like it's it's funny. Um, you know, I watch people play um, Mario Maker, and there's there's levels where that are upside down, and it's like I don't understand why they just don't turn their screens upside down because it's I don't know. I know some people can read upside down and backwards, like in a mirror. I feel like I can barely read forwards. Um, yeah, that last phase is, I think, going to be significantly like a real problem. That, that's what I'm trying to say.
Maybe, maybe what I'll do in this one is start with the chase um, roundabout and then switch to the chaser once. Gosh darn it! Once the dogs, uh, once they become fewer dogs. I find it difficult to see the lasers, honestly. Right, right into it. Man, this is tough. Like, I find it difficult to even visually see the lasers. They're so faint. This is, um... It feels doable, but only through sheer luck. Like, how... How does my brain work that I think it's not even enough just to turn my head? I think I need to turn the controller, too. <laughs> Um, let's give it a couple more tries, and then maybe we'll move on to another boss. Um, I think the first the first phase definitely needs to be hitless. It seems like when you jump, the plane doesn't follow you. Yeah, it's only when you're on the plane. Which I think is a good design decision, but it's um, it makes the it makes it less responsive, which which I think is the point, but it's something to be aware of. I wonder if pea shooter is better, because um, I think I'm I I think I can mostly point at him. I do want to go away.
Oh. Oh, man. Um, not sure. The time. Oh, it's really close. I don't know if that's going to count, but... Oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm, um... I'm not, not so good at being Bob Ross right now, but, um... I'm really glad we don't have to do that again. The, the sideways thing. I think it's great design. I love it. But trying to get perfect with the sideways thing, it's not super fun for me. So, uh... I'm, I'm glad we're through it. Let's um, let's skip this one. I think I think it's gonna be fine, but I want to play this one. Um, we'll probably we'll do the same. We'll start with Chaser and see how it goes. But let's see. The, the little spider flicks around the different levels. Let's see. How Like, it's actually interesting because um, he's, he's just right there, you know? He's not even moving very fast, but most of my shots are missing. This is a good track, too. A banger, as the kids say. I hate, I hate that, though. You know, who, who says that? Really, who says bang? Um, so I think that's doable with the roundabout, but... I don't know if that's efficient. This one is too much. I think I'm going to need to switch to the chaser. The music is going in and out again, which I wasn't sure before whether it was a bug or a feature, and I'm still not sure. And now this one? We basically just need to dodge the tongue. Oh yeah, and then we have to worry about that ball. This is one of the few places where I actually feel like Miss Chalice is going to make things harder because... Um... Oh, that wasn't a lot of damage. That was a slow third phase. We could try the air weapon. I'm not sure. See, I noticed the chasers touch, um, go into the tongue, go into the ball. I'm not sure what's really taking damage, but hopefully it's the head? So I'm going to switch second phase. Second phase definitely needs Chaser, just for my own sanity. Um, but what I was trying to say was that Miss Chalice, her parry is a dash, and the tongue is horizontal, so like you might be able to do it, but it's not obvious exactly how how much tolerance there is. So we could let's try doing crack shot. At this point, you know, I'm I'm getting close to like just looking at the wiki, something like that, because it would be really nice to know the values. Now. 
I like I've said before, we could, we could calculate it. Um, Uh, why didn't it die? Well, that didn't seem fair. I feel like we're not getting nearly as many parries as we did last time. What hit us? That's tough. When she's on the side that you need to drop down on, it's like, okay. So, certainly the snail takes damage, but at this point, there's no snail. So, it's attacking the tongue. I kind of want to change back to Chaser. Come on, give us... Give us some pink. Yeah, I don't even know if we've gotten, I think, two parries, but... Um, I'm trying this round with the... With the... Uh, roundabout, but... It's too much brain. Too much brain. Um, just, I'm just stopping to think. I don't think there's any other strategy for that second phase. Like, these music bars extend to the end of the screen. And um, so you have to do the circle thing, I think. There's no way to like jump over it, I think. Which is annoying because sometimes she's in the way. And like I was saying in the first video, if you go out too far, you're too slow. Right? It's um it moves quite a bit faster the further away it is from this from the sun. Ooh, that was, that was not good. Well, 
Oh, hold on. He doesn't always call it the same pattern. This last time he went to the second level. Um, my fingers are getting a little confused going between... Oh my gosh! Going between dashing and... Holding the weapon spray, whatever that's called. Yeah, this is always a problem in these kinds of games. When you're holding down to shoot down, and then you jump, you you wind up going through the floor. Uh, because down and jump goes through the floor, even though what you want to be doing is shooting down and jumping. Which is um, it's what you want to do half the time, and half the time you want to fall fall through. I didn't see that. That I saw. This one's tough. This one's tough. It doesn't even feel doable yet. Maybe we should do it with 100% chaser. Just to see what our time is. Right, because a big part of this first problem is that I'm trying to do all this fancy stuff with aiming. I, I'm not sure if you've given me any pinks yet. So we have one, two, well that's a shame. Oh, that was super quick, right? That's the strat. Chase her at the very beginning until it gets crazy. I mean, uh, roundabout. My button, my finger slipped. That was just a mistake. Tried to get fancy, and instead of dodging, I thought about attacking. Oh, I might die. That last phase is long. I feel like we're not shooting the right thing. Like, is the tongue taking damage? Or is it just attracting shots? I do not know. Mm-hmm. 
lot of my lot of my bullets wind up not having a target. I'm thinking maybe this, even though this does less damage, it actually more of my shots might connect, and so it might do more damage per time per second. That's fair. Again, I fell through instead of jumping. Uh, that was definitely faster. It's going up. That time there was a barrel on the way, and that was a that was just a mistake. So, not great. Second phase is tough. First phase is tough. Third phase is tough. Maybe. I was thinking that it maybe it would be slow enough that I could actually bury it from the side, but that thing came out real fast. This is a tough one. Falling through is a serious problem. Well, I can't. As tough as this is, between the speed and the hit points, I'm not getting the parries either. Like, I went for it just to see if I could get it, but um, not getting the parries. Wow. How... How are you supposed to dodge that?
No, no. I need the parents. Okay, that's two parries. Oh, bollocks. Bollocks. But hey. No, it's so far away. No. Well, I think that's one parry. Um, well, I just killed that. I, I couldn't have dropped. Oh, she has a hitbox! Okay, alright, well, you know. Well, I hope that counts, because I took a risk. And, it, and I guess it worked. Oh, no. oh, it's all falling apart now. Wow, this one's tough. All right, we're going to come back to this. I think I'm going to try the pony, the horse. That one, that one is really the first one where I felt like I need significant more practice before it'll happen. Um, so this is a, this is a plain one. Now... Hmm. Now with the plane, Miss Chalice doesn't have so much of an advantage because her super doesn't give me hearts anymore. So this one seems like the the one to go for because it's basically three extra hit points, no downside. And, right, because there's, there's no, it doesn't say that it lowers your attack. Good day for a well battle. You're up. Yeah, so he, ha he has two. Uh, remember we were talking about, she has three. Ooh, man, this is a lot going on with uh, an expert. Uh, I need some stuff to parry. Uh, what, what, what is parry? What is parry for here? I'm not sure we've seen anything parry. A great slam and then some. Here goes. 
Okay, so cactus things can be variable. Um, so that means allow the cactus. Oh, I didn't even I didn't even see that. But we did get the help. Uh, but that I have I have to allow the cactus, which is a real concern. Ooh, man, this is another one that's tough. So, could be some impairment, but I don't see anything. Alright, so on Expert, this is serious business, too. Ooh. Like, this one was tough on regular. I don't know if that's quicker, but or if I'm slower, but it feels. So I see the wanted poster coming out sometimes, and I'm just trying to figure out what that signals. I actually don't know. Then the safes. Oof. All right, well. So the money's not so bad, but the safes I find to be tougher. And then this phase. Is that is that pink or red? That, that's red. Why do they use red? Why do they use red? You know, if you're gonna pick a color like pink to be this magical peri peri color, don't use red. Like, what's the difference between red and pink anyway? Aren't they the same thing? We had to deal with the dynamite and the coins, huh? Hardly seems fair. Uh, I don't think we have a single parry. If I can't get to six parries, you know, because some fights you have like 20 parries because there's some sort of thing in the fight. Uh, what's, a, what's a good example? Like, 
um, briny, briny beard. There, there are more parries when the sausages, the fourth phase comes out. Um, I'm thinking maybe, maybe to switch to the, the plus two hearts, but. You know, it could be that this ring is actually making my shots weaker and just doesn't say so. Good day for a well Here goes. Good day for a well Now go. No. I wonder how much of the difficulty of this is the fact that it's 5 in the morning and how much of the difficulty is the fact that it's expert. Pink or red? I, I don't know. That one's pink. Probably that third phase I should focus on. I should assume that they're red if I can't tell they're pink. For one. It's it's the shortest phase. A brawl is surely brewing. And begin. This this first one is what's gonna destroy me. And honestly, the it's the dynamite. If it was, if everything but the dynamite, I feel like I could handle it. I guess the I guess the lesson is don't dodge at the top of the screen, but questionable. This match will get red hot. 
I just... I, the way that I dodge... In order to dodge the dynamite, I cannot focus on the rest of the screen. And the, and the dynamite, once it comes in the screen, right, I'm focused on it. And I have to wait because sometimes I'll drop it to the right, sometimes I'll drop it to the left, and then I have to wait as it goes down. Like, that's, that's clearly the problem. I shouldn't be focused so much on it, but that's what's happening. Maybe I should, I would say I should stay low, but I can't. Right? I need to be where the cow is. Man, this one's tough. I feel like this is the toughest that we've done so far. Even tougher, even tougher than the spider. Or the bugs. This is harder than Wally Warbles. In terms of like there just been so much going on. doesn't even go straight down. It actually he throws the dynamite, I think, at an angle? Or can throw the dynamite? What? Interestingly, I think I hit the um, the button that makes you go little at the same time I hit the parry button. And uh, the little to press it.
unfortunate. We haven't even gotten to the last phase. Now, granted, the last phase, at least on normal, was the easiest for me. But not only do we need to get there, we need to beat it, and we need to have three health. At the end. This match will get red hot. You're up. Hmm. This may not be a... Uh, couple of hours kind of thing. Wow. Good day for a well battle. And begin. Here's a real high class. Definitely should switch to the bombs when I'm forced into the air. But it's one more thing to think about, right? Wow. This this one is designed to be cruel. The way that the horizontal eels prevent you from switching, but you, your goal is to switch. You, you need to switch. Um, from top to bottom. That donkey has just enough health to get annoying. Good day for a well battle. It's on. You can't kill the bird, I don't think, that drops the, uh... I knew I had to parry, I, oh, but I actually didn't. I had three health. So in my head, I needed that next parry to get the health. Oh, that's such a shame. I was so close. Oh. So yeah, I in my head, I was like, oh, I, I definitely need another health. So I'm going to have to take this parry, and I took the risk. So, so that shows it's possible. 
but I feel like we got really good luck on that second phase. Um, I did, I did do something, you know, you make your own luck. I did something that made the second phase a bit easier, which was use the bomb in the second phase. Um, it does significant damage and kind of skips over it, because that's... Like, the first phase you can restart on. Second phase, take a lot of damage and want to skip over it. The third phase, I played it safe. That was that was what was going through my head. I know I stopped talking. A brawl is surely brewing. Now go. Good day for a swell battle. It's on. Didn't see it. Man, that light, that, that dynamite is just such a bear. decision. Oh, that's gotta be it. That's oh, my God. oh man. What? How is my HP zero? I had three health. I call shenanigans. Extra health has always counted as extra health. Like, I want to go back to the video. Wasn't, wasn't the previous phase at two of three? So now the test is I have to get to the end again. I feel like it was a glitch, but... If it's not a glitch, then I need to switch to a different charm. Which is going to make it harder. Oh, I was so happy. I was so happy.
that's it. I can't I can't recover now. I'm gonna go through just to see see if I can see the health at the end, but So, I'm expecting to see one of three. So, that parry ring must not count as help the way this these things count as help. Which is a real shame, because... Uh, I mean, it still could be a glitch, but... The time was significantly slower, and I assume that's because of the damage decrease. But it could also be because I was playing it um, slow, like in this first phase. I mean, both, both, you know, doesn't have to be one or the other. Right, you need to transition from top to bottom, and of course those uh, those eels are horizontal. It's it's devilishly designed. They don't even have consistent um, heights, uh, widths. Well, I really thought he'd switch. Come on. Boy, the... That's a hard phase. At this point, it's impossible. That was a good shot. That was not so good. Yeah, so this part is tough for me. Because you go to the top to a dodge. If you go to the bottom, you don't have time to adjust for the, the, the angle. There's really no good place to be. And now it's impossible. A brawl is surely brewing. It's on. A brawl is surely brewing. 
Can't stand to the right. Can't stand to the left. Can't stand to the top. Can't stand to the bottom. Um. I think that was just a little too high. I, ju I just got the fact that the cow turns into 100% beef sausages. Oh, that is rough. No. No. One hit point away. One hit point away. Oh, the time was great. So I was worried about my time, but um, some of the things that I'm doing, like switching to the bombs, seems to be helping with time so now that i know the time is good it's just just the, it's just the hit points oh, it's definitely doable oh man that sausage phase is rough all the first three phases are so hard
Oh, I think that was it. I think that was it. Oh, the time is close. But we did it. <laughs> The adrenaline, the endorphins, quite satisfying. All right, that leaves one more regular boss. Moonshine Mob, which is meant to be the second. And then the, uh, the final boss. So, we've been using, yeah, I, th I think it, it still makes sense to go back to uh, Miss Chalice, because her super art basically gives you two extra hearts. Um, now the question is, what about these fellas? Now I gotta remember the controls to dash. Right? It's very different than flying a plane. Um, it's interesting, you know, watching people who are legitimately good um, and the kinds of things that they don't struggle with. Man, this is the phase I think that is giving me the most trouble. Like. Part of it is a knowledge thing. I don't know where I'm supposed to be shooting. I don't know what actually takes damage. It doesn't feel like his tongue takes damage, even though it is flashing. Some, sometimes in this game, things flash, even though it's not actually like a, like a target. First phase is horrible. Second phase is horrible. I wonder. Let's. Um, Right, okay, it says good damage. So, right, we've got average. I wish it says average here. Like, is good worse than average, or is good... You'd think good would be better than average. Because average is average. Good is good. But I bet it's average damage, or even worse than average. And... Right, and then weaker aim projectiles. So this is definitely better than Chaser, if 
you can hit. You can't hit, right? You sort of get that secondary damage. It's probably really the best weapon. I feel like all I feel like what we're doing is right. Maybe I just need to rely more on the crack shot. Well, even if I even if I beat it, if I don't get the parries, uh, this isn't gonna this isn't gonna count. I'm not sure why I wanted to be on the second level there. At this point, at this point, it's, it's eliminable. But I need to figure this out. Like, what what is going on? So you you. You really, you, you have to switch back and forth from the left and the right because that thing comes out instantaneously. I did notice though that I was shooting off screen and it wasn't coming back on screen. So maybe I should switch to the tracer. Although, I don't know if the chaser would even come back on screen if I'm right at the edge. But it'd be nice to finish this at least once. I don't think we finished it once. Yeah, this is super low damage. Sus. Sus. I mean, that was, it was definitely my fault, but I don't like it. So one one thing I can do better there is if I'm if I'm l late or slow. It might be worth waiting and actually letting the yellow pass over me before it goes red, because I, I get a little bit more time. The dance is over, there's no excuse. You couldn't handle the Gable Juice. Parries are tough. Like, I'm lucky to get two parries on the first round.
Come on. This is sometimes it's sometimes they just don't come. Oh, well, that's certainly something. Wait, did I kill the bar before he could shoot his weapon? My gosh. I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, yeah, forgot his collision. I'm not getting the, uh, the super I need here. This is absurdly slow. Like, I'm not shooting the right thing, and I don't know what I'm supposed to be shooting. Wasn't there something that tried to kill me after the match? So... I got an achievement. I'm really hoping it's for perfect. Oh, it's three minutes! I'm, I was a minute over. I mean, I assume that I still need two minutes, but holy crap, a minute over? What am I supposed to do in that last phase? How is that last phase supposed to go? So Ranger obtain an A rank or higher on all bosses in equal. What am I supposed to shoot that I'm not shooting? So I, I don't think I can do re even if I knew what to shoot. I don't think roundabout is the ticket. Maybe lobber if the tongue is the thing? 
I wish I knew. I wish I knew what I'm supposed to shoot. I think I'm going to look that up. You know, maybe watch somebody else play it who's figured it out. Let's give uh, the Salt Boss a try. I don't really remember what his deal was, but I remember it as being decently easy. But that was on the course. Okay, so I'm not hitting anything. Alright, I need this weapon. Because I'm not I'm not hitting anything. Um, and then it becomes basically dodge while holding the shoot. Now I wonder, I wonder if you miss every shot, is Chaser better? Honestly, that phase goes by pretty quick, so... If Chaser's not better, I'd be surprised. I mean, if Chaser is better, I'd be surprised. Ah, you can't. Um, my la la la. I have hair in my eye. We've got that boomerang sound from uh, King Dice, the, the one with the cigars. I've always liked that fight. It's very simple. I mean, I guess they all are. Boy, this, uh, this round's got a lot going on. I feel like I have to do this. Like maybe, maybe I try to aim up to get that bonus damage, but I definitely want to keep this. Even for fire in normal, or is that new? Maybe it was only one fire. Okay, this one was easy, but there was definitely no fire before. And you can't kill the fire, it appears. Oh, you why would why would you dash into the fire? last phases were. So let's, um, let's get this bad boy. Ooh, Cyclone might be good. Let's try Cyclone. Still have to aim. I think I'd rather be able to stand in the middle. You know, I like sugar. Sugar's got parries. Hmm. 
No, I don't get invulnerability frames. Well, that's that's a real shame. I went for the parry, thinking I'd get invulnerability frames. Oh, and I lost my X. So, I don't think the fire moves. My power grows with much aplomb. Your end is here, but my call. Um, I've been worried that the fire moves left and right, but I don't think it actually does. Oh man, that's rough. Like, this fire is much worse than the fire on the second phase. Yeah, sugar's what I want. Give me give me all the sugar. Oh, but they need to be pink sugars. Don't like the limes. Don't like the limes so much. And I really don't like animal crackers. Don't like that. Just like the sugar. Oh, didn't see it. <sighs> on the one hand, I feel like that phase is pretty straightforward. Um, but on the other hand, it's kicking my butt. Like, the first phase seems to be the toughest. In terms of, like, the amount of stuff that's going on. Okay, I think we've had enough cookies. Oh no! No! Come back! Come back! Come back! I... Oh. <laughs> I'm dashed over both of them. Ooh, that was close. That's real close. Nonsense. I don't think the leaves moved left and right last time. Maybe they did. But it's kind of freaking me out now.
Oh, uh, this was this was fairly easy, right? It was just oh no, this is something else. This wasn't so bad. Oh 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 oh! All right, and then you climb. Oh yeah, the heart. Which we don't know if you can parry. What? Can parry, but only every once in a while. How do we get two hearts? How did I have a heart and then die? And also, how did I parry it and not parry it? I think that was a bug. At least one of those was a bug. The mark of my salinity shall scar thy five glades. Um, yeah, the last two phases are pretty straightforward. So this seems doable. And the and the phases are definitely in order of difficulty. that come from? Well, we've already lost. Good day. <clears throat> well goes. That line came from freaking downtown. Are any of these strawberries pink? I don't think so, but again. Why why use red? So I have a... It, okay, I think the hand eats the heart. It deletes it, but, but it's visually still there. I'm not so sure about that. Uh, I don't know about that. That was a little sketch. Here they 
I feel like his arm should be full of salt. I guess it shouldn't be focusing on his arms. And I forgot I can dodge roll. That, that might that might come in handy. Maybe. maybe. The nice thing about dashing is that you you may still have a jump, whereas with the dodge roll you're just there. At least that makes sense in my head. So, I have a heart. If I finish this phase, well, I'm kind of glad we took the hit. Otherwise, I think it would have been wasted. So, they don't move left and right, but what they do do is jump. So I don't know about time, but I think we did everything else. It's gold. Yes. All right. Couple of I feel so bad for him. Well, we've only got one more boss left to... to perfect. Speaking of which, I was... Speaking of perfect, I was thinking about that. I'm really surprised there's no run and gun stage. Like, did I miss it? To do... To do an island without a run and gun? Like... What's interesting about that is that I actually don't really like the running gun stages, and so maybe no one does, and that's what they decided, but I'm really just surprised that they don't have one. I love that they copyright, that they write on here, 1930. Just press start. Just press start to skip it. 
Um, I should probably quit, but I'm gonna give the spider slash anteater boss another little shot. We're at 94%, so I don't think we've missed a stage. So this is this is all that's left. We've got So, you know, we had uh, we had three minutes on this boss the last time we beat it. So I have to increase damage. I don't exactly know how to do that. Even then, it's still quite difficult. Maybe one in ten, one in twenty. Why does it always tell me to switch weapons? Like, I know. And the parries too, that's a, that's another problem. This one this one's freaking tough. Like we've had too many greens. Well, I didn't mean to kill that. Ah. Is it worth it? Probably not. Oops. I think we're doing more damage with this than the tracer. I have to aim it. I don't know if we're going to save a minute. And then there's the phase afterwards, right? The secret. Hadn't even stopped flashing. Oh, 
Okay, just not going to blow up. It must be programmed in a way that it's a transition into its space that sets it off. And so when you start too close to it, it doesn't trigger, which I kind of consider a buggy bug. Speaking of, speaking of bugs. Nope. I gotta get those parries, because that third phase, I don't think I can get parries. I mean, it, it is possible, we have seen it done, but I, I don't think I can do it without taking damage. Oh, I was just off. Well, may maybe it's more doable than I thought, but... Oh, maybe I'm supposed to hit the trunk. Maybe the trick... Are they called trunks on an anime? What would you call them? Yeah, that's that's definitely it. So I need to hit the snout slash trunk. <laughs> Killed me. What a what a punk. Surprise! Forgetting about the boss ain't wise. Um It seems doable. Like we we've dramatically decreased the time between trying to get these extra shots in with the roundabout in the first phase um, and then this last phase, right? So the time I don't think is going to be an issue, but now the issue is getting through the second phase and getting enough parries. Like, I shouldn't be killing him. One. Two. 
Uh, why isn't that going off? Okay, not sure what hit me. Wow, that was really close. <laughs> no! Oh. oh, it wasn't fast enough. Okay, well, we've definitely figured out what takes damage in that last phase. Oh, man. So... I actually think I should have switched to roundabout because I wound up staying on the side of the trunk, of the snout. So... It's definitely doable, but man. Sometimes I fail to double jump just because I don't press the button twice. I think we have the parries. It's not what I want to do. Oh. Okay. Come on, go. Why?
boy, that was something. Not I'm not doing damage. Really? After the phase ends? Come on. The snout is definitely the key. There's no doubt about it now. Tons of damage. Not sure what hit me. I can roll through it. Well, that is significantly easier. Sauce? What? No. Like, I'm kind of just betting it's not going to be on the bottom, which is... Uh... Alright, so I, I need to turn around. Oh, they still go over him. Maybe... Maybe it's better just to stand on the bottom for that. I was I was hoping I could just get a bunch of shots like ready for him when it comes up. And it's still 214. 
And we didn't get the parries. It's a good chance to check about that card. Just to... Oh, this is says A+. Plus. Why, why do all of these say A- minus if they're all S's? That that third phase we went super super quick, and it's two twelve. Come on, we need to speed up the first phase, I think. Because you can definitely tell sometimes it goes super quick and sometimes it goes super slow. That was that was nice and quick. Parries. No, 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 no. no. So close. Oh, and it was time to. <sighs> okay, well. Alright, so I haven't been super positive tonight. But it's important to remember you can see the progress, definitely getting better, getting closer and closer each time. It's a little frustrating, but it's so, like, I swear within one second we got hit, but it's doable. And after getting the parry off the tongue, too. I don't know if I need another pair. This is 
third phase is significantly easier than it was. It's like I can't quite I can't quite reach him. He's in just the right spot. Oh wow, yeah, we only got one fairy. We gotta start counting them out, I suppose. Um, momentum off of that. I wonder if the roll is long enough that I can roll through the spider. Not really sure I'm willing to try. Oh, I need it's pink, man. That's two parrots. Oh, you can't roll through them if he stops. So I, I've noticed this thing. I haven't said it, but you can see what he's going to do as he comes on the screen. He's either carrying the caterpillar or he's got a phone in his hand. He's, you know, and each of those makes him stop and do that activity. Um, and sometimes he's not carrying anything, in which case he's actually going to walk all the way over.
another parry. Before I got hit. Wow. Like, you can do it. You can get the parry. Oh, man. saying with that one. Something and then some. Well, I really wish it had put that. I feel like if I don't get the parries in the first two rounds, it's too risky. Like, I, I, like, sure, maybe, maybe you can do it, but one. Oh, my shark. I think I need one more.
Oh man, if I'm one parry short, I'm gonna be so sad. I feel like I have to be. And I I missed that parry right at the end too. Heartbreaking. Heartbreaking. Improvement can definitely be seen. You know, there's no doubt about it. It's gonna happen. It's just... I guess I was hoping it would happen. Give me some pinks. Give me some pinks. Give me three pinks in the first round, please. This, uh, this fan is blowing hair in my face. It's so tickly. I don't think I have any, right? What? Maybe, maybe one. What hit me? That's gotta be it. That's gotta be it. Unless time, unless it's time. Wow, we've came so far. Okay, so I kind of expected an achievement. I mean, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to seem shallow or anything, but, uh, how is that not an achievement? How is that not an achievement? There's one secret achievement. If you keep knocking heads around the cell, might claim the quest. How was that not the secret achievement? Like, okay, so, you know, accomplishment is its own reward. But at the same time, <laughs> something for it. We've got satisfactory, not satisfactory. I've seen writings that say it despises bravery. With a greater foe, the more evil shall go. Am I supposed to beat something on expert and power it up? At any rate, we've definitely beat everything on S. Let's check the palace and...
I mean, we've beaten the gauntlet. We've beaten the gauntlet with Cuphead. We've beaten the gauntlet with Miss Chalice. I honestly don't know what's left, but... But I thought that would do something. Well, it didn't. And, um... So there's two more that I know about, because they're on Steam, and I'm looking at Steam. So defeat a boss without killing any of its minions. That seems really difficult. Um, all these bosses seem to have tons of minions, and we beat a lot of them using, you know, chaser kind of weapons. And then have nine hit points at one time, which I think means take the parry ring and go back to uh, King Dice. And then one hidden achievement, which I think I'm, and I think I'm gonna look up because I don't really know what else there is to do, um, unless it has something to do with beating a boss on expert with, with the, with the cursed relic. But we did that on Isle One, so. Um, you know, at the, at the, I could spend five hours trying to beat one of these bosses with the first relic on expert on this island, which means not having this chalice, one hit point. Maybe that's what it wants us to do, but I'm not going to do it without knowing that that's something. Um, so I think, I think with that, I'm going to, um, in the video and maybe find out what that missing achievement is and maybe do one more of these. So thanks everybody and I'll see you next time.